Breast Cancer Awareness Month is just weeks away, and usually during that time of year, you see a lot of pink ribbons and pink shirts in honor of survivors. But today's guest says one in eight women should think no pink, actually. Please welcome author of Think No Pink and Breast Cancer Survivor, MJ Jenkins, to the studio. Thanks so much for being here. Happy Breast Cancer Awareness Month, <laughs> coming up just a few weeks away. Yes. You know, as a, as a uh, representative of the American Cancer Society, one in eight women will be diagnosed with invasive ductal carcinoma breast cancer. That's mm -hmm. the most common type of breast cancer women can get. And I am one of those eight women. With the help of Angelina Jolie's breast surgeon today, four years later, I am cancer free. Congratulations. <laughs> You had a great doctor then. <laughs> the best. And with, you know, I wrote, it actually it prompted me to write a book. Why one in eight women should think no pink. Yeah, I don't, explain that to well, me. Well, you know, you we think see no pink so much. because you think no cancer. So if you think no cancer, there is no need for any pink ribbons out there. Mm. And that's why I wanted to write why one in eight women should think no pink because your thoughts, your words, your actions will either help you survive or they will kill you. <laughs> Literally. Okay, you unfortunately. Know, there, there's three huge mistakes actually that I documented when I was going through my breast cancer. The first okay. is, um, you know, letting your midsection bulk up and having too much fat around your midsection has been mm. proven. Women that carry fat around their midsections are more likely to get breast cancer than women that lead fit and healthy lifestyles. Wow, and, I didn't know that. And the, the best part for me was, Eating, having uh, early detection. So don't put off your breast cancer screenings and get early detection. If I had not detected my breast cancer as, as early as I did, I wouldn't be here in this beautiful studio with you beautiful people. You know, <laughs> today I would be dead. And the third mistake that I wanted to tell women about for Breast Cancer Awareness Month is avoid those cancer-causing foods. And now I'm going to do a whole segment in the next hour oh. on cancer-causing foods. And that's why I'm your BFF for breast cancer. You think it's best friend? Well, actually, it's B for believe. You need to believe you will survive in good thoughts, good yes. words. Feed your body good foods. We're going to talk about avoid cancer-causing foods. But I have a little surprise. Coco Chanel's here. She's my, <laughs> B she's my BFF for breast cancer because she's helping me to survive and to heal and, and to think good thoughts and to have someone close to your heart when you go through healing and breast cancer. And then finally, F in, F in my BFF solution for women out there is for freedom, the freedom to, to recreate and redesign the way you want it. Your life needs to be eating cancer, avoid cancer causing foods. Yes. Get out and walk with me on the making strides against can cancer walks, against breast cancer. And there's going to be some here, especially all over. There's 30 of them all over Miami <laughs> and all over the world, frankly. I'm going to be out there at, um, October 2nd for San Diego Chargers. So come out and, oh, wow. and talk about real men wear pink during the month of October. <laughs> I love that. I love that. We're going to do a whole segment on talking about fundraise to fundraise during Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And that's why I invite you to think no pink. Think no pink, guys. Avoid, uh, avoid breast cancer. It's just a frame of mind, right, basically? Yeah, positive words, actions, surround yourself with positive people will, number one, help you to survive breast cancer. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, MJ, for being here. If you guys want more information to keep in mind, thank you so much. Make sure you visit our website. It's uh, studiodtelevision.com. You get more information on her book, Think No Pink, things like that. We're so excited to have you and Coco. Thank you guys so Think much no for pink. being here. Think no pink. Exactly. <laughs> Happy Breast Cancer Awareness Month. <laughs> What's going on over there, guys?